My name is Helen O'Toole and I'm an artist working in Seattle. When I got accepted for this show, I thought first that I wanted to work on a body of paintings that would tie together thematically. And initially I was kind of calling them the letter frack series. That was a, a way of loosely bonding the, the paintings together. The painting To Remember. I started with that painting probably last January. And after about a month, I had to start over because the ground cracked. I think even though I cursed the ground and <laughs> whatnot, I was really upset at having to start over. I think it was really good for me to have to cut up the canvas. At that stage, I had this big red painting ready to work on called Migration. I was adamant though that I wasn't going to bring in recognisable forms, such as maybe a mountain or a lake. <laughs> and then when I started the painting to remember, when I was ready to the ground and everything was ready, to, ready for me to paint on it, I again started much more abstractly. I wanted to work to um, really consider the specificity of the rectangle in the painting. So I was kind of working with these really long bands of kind of whitish, greyish colours to begin with. And I used to work vertically for a long time. Going way back, I wouldn't use a horizontal format because I didn't want my work to be categorised as landscape painting. This time I decided that I would actually use the rectangle to maybe inform the way I built the painting. And I felt that by using a vertical format and maybe suggesting a kind of aerial view, but not allowing it to be just about that, that I could maybe metaphorically address some of the issues I was interested in, in relation to this particular place that where the work kind of stemmed from. I suppose issue, idea of landscape will come up when looking at the paintings because it's there. And I think it's there because of where I grew up really to a large degree. Obviously, from my accent, I'm Irish and I grew up in the west of Ireland, a place called Ballantubber. The Irish landscape is, you know, on the one level, it's very beautiful. But, you know, I think, you know, you take back a layer and there's history there. I suppose in a way, I feel like my work kind of is rooted in that particular place or comes out of it. I mean, I wouldn't go around labeling myself as a Northwest artist, but that's where I live. From my own perspective, I think that the place has probably influenced me. Seattle is fantastic. I think there's a lot of really cutting edge work happening in this region. Possibly not shown as much because we're a little bit cut off from the main kind of drag of museums and galleries on the East Coast or in Europe. But we're not living in isolation. I think it was helpful in this body of work to really stay with an idea and to not make it literal, but to allow you, the viewer to get inside the work and perhaps maybe feel some of that in the paintings. <laughs>